Judy, thank you for coming in, and thank you for bringing us this very nice pocket watch. Tell me the history behind it or what you know about it. Well, I know that the pocket watch belonged to my great-grandmother's second husband. His name was Fred J. Marcus. I don't really know what kind of business he was in, but I feel like he carried this, you know, most of his life, and it ended up being a family heirloom that I happened to be lucky enough to have. Okay, and I'm assuming the chain went with it? Yes, the chain did, and I think the watch came from Louisville. Uh, it's engraved, or not engraved, but there's markings on it that says it's from Louisville. And, and it has what we commonly refer to as a half Albert pocket watch chain, which was very typical for the 20s. It's a 16 size pocket watch. It's from Iron and Gerardet, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. who were very famous for their private label pocket watches, which means they didn't make a watch, they bought them in. Oh, okay. You're a beautiful multicolored engraving all on the watch. And over here we have a small little stone that's missing. Probably would have been a diamond. Do we know anything about that? Well, actually, yes. My grandmother told me that that diamond ended up in my mother's engagement ring. So I thought that was quite an interesting uh, little story. It was a small diamond. Um, and I remember seeing the ring, and it did have a small diamond. But it was uh, my mom's engagement ring. Well, maybe one day you can reunite it with the piece because it takes a small diamond set right there. Oh, I'll, I'll try. And the watch has a beautiful signature on the dial that says uh, Iron and Gadet, and it's 404 West Market Street, uh, Louisville, Kentucky. So it is a watch that was retailed after 1900. Mm -hmm. And what has been the common value that the family has placed on this watch and chain? Uh, well, I, I tried to research a little bit online, but I, I wasn't very successful. I was thinking it might be worth maybe a thousand dollars. Well, a watch like this, if it was just simply a gold watch, a plain gold watch probably might be worth a thousand dollars. But this watch, because of this fantastic, it's a great size, it's mm -hmm. an 18 size, Phenomenal, multicolored gold, beautiful side, reunited with the diamond, with a, a gold chain, would be worth somewhere between $5,500 and $6,500. Wow, that's a lot. I'm pretty happy with that. <laughs> thank and, you. And again, thank you for bringing in and sharing with it. It is a beautiful piece, and the fact it was retailed in Louisville is fantastic. Thank you very much. Thank you.